Bellevue police show just how quickly and easily a thief can cut out your car's catalytic converter and be gone with it. It is clear this problem is not going away and not slowing down. Not by a long shot. In Bellevue alone, the city has seen a nearly 600% increase in catalytic converter thefts in just one year. In Kirkland, that number is nearly 300%. King County has seen the number jump from just 20 cases a year to four every single day. Bellevue Police Chief Wendell Shirley says the situation is growing much more serious. Catalytic converter thefts are not only an expensive crime for the victims, it can also be dangerous as we're finding thieves now are arming themselves with weapons. These nine east side police agencies are now forming a task force to share leads, pool resources and crack down on both the thieves stealing the units and shady recyclers buying them. A catalytic converter can bring a criminal a few hundred dollars for their precious metals, but cost the victim five times that and even more. Catalytic converter theft is particularly impactful crime directly impacting an individual or family's ability to move around the community for work, for school, or for basic needs. Two bills are currently working their way through Olympia right now that would require recyclers to keep strict records showing proof the device isn't stolen, impose heavier fines, and create a statewide task force. All proposals Bothell Stop. Police Chief it's Ken Superlick says would be very welcome. Whether it's uh, increasing funding for uh, specialty units, um, whether it's assisting with prosecution, um, any of those things. This is a team effort, the community, law enforcement, the prosecutor's office. Now, as we've seen, these thieves are increasingly willing to use violence to steal a catalytic converter. Police say if you see it or probably more like if you hear it happening in your driveway, they say don't approach them. Just call 911 as soon as possible and be a good witness. Try to take some pictures or video if you can. Live in Bellevue tonight, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.